Hello guys, you're welcome back to another video. Is your favorite girl Gaze Wayoma? In case today is your first time of coming across my page, like, share, and follow. And if you're on YouTube, like, share, and subscribe. And don't forget to turn on your notification bell so that whenever I upload videos, you'll be among the first person to watch my video. Thank you. So guys, today's gist, hmm, I saw it on Dr. Justin Dean's page and I'm like, like, is my eyes paining me or what? Do I have eye problem or what? And he says, this is my apology to Obidi's family about the chronic cheating claim. And he tagged Cora Obidi and tagged Nancy Ume and her dad, dad, then in bracket, he wrote Papa. June and Atina are my children and I love them. I will be there for them every day, even if I am not married to Cora. Hmm, my people, this is what Justin Dean wrote and tag Cora Obidi and Nancy Ume. This guy, hmm, this guy has not moved on no, and depression is real, my people. This guy needs to be talked to. He needs to get a therapist to talk to him. Like this is three years now. And yet he has not moved on. He's talking about his ex-wife. I don't get it, my people. Look at this picture you're seeing here is when he came to Nigeria and got married to Cora Obidi. He came to a very lovely family. This is Cora Obidi's dad by the left side and her uncle by the right side. Guys, look at Justin. He came to a very responsible family, a good family like but he messed himself up. It's a pity. The guy is really regretting. Like, he's regretting. He's just praying that the hands of the clock will be turned back. But as it stands, it's not possible. Because this guy came on the internet and messed the ex-wife up. Look at what he is apologizing. Do you think, uh, Justin Dr. Dean, do you think it's just something that you will come on the internet and just tag him, tag uh your your wife, your ex-wife and the sister and be asking for apology. No, you have to make a way and go to this family and apologize to them. Yes, look at beautiful children, daughters that she gave to you and you came to the internet to tell us that she's cheating on you, that you are not even sure if Athena is your daughter, if June is your daughter. Hey, the disgrace no be here. I'm telling you guys, this is when Cora is pregnant for Athena. They went to visit the mom in Justin's uh, village. This is them. Honestly, guys, now that guy is really, really regretting because these bloggers, they really messed him up. If you people know how this case started up, this guy came to the internet and started saying a lot of things. And Cora Obidi said that she called him when he was about making this attempt of going to, you know, say some things which he's not supposed to say pub publicly. She called him, knelt down, cried to him and begged him, we can settle things amicably. And he said, no, no, he came to the internet, my goodness. My people, he came and said a lot of things. Even we thought it was just a prank, you know, family prank like other people did. And before you know it, it wasn't a prank. It was real till today. And instead of this guy to make peace and try to make things easy for his ex, he makes it so difficult and difficult for her. And yet he is not at peace with himself. Yes, he is so frustrated. He's so depressed. You know, the girl's success is really, really torturing him. And there must be something that he is seeing in Cora that is making him feel so bad at this point. But Justin, I have to advise you. It's not late. Go and make peace with Cora's family. Go and make peace with Cora. You still have that opportunity. You know, we can't never say never. Okay, because Cora still loves and respects you. Even the fact that the both of you are not together, Cora still loves and respects you. She doesn't talk about you. She doesn't disrespect you. She respects the fact that you are her children's father. Yes, and she accepted that 
you people are going to run it 50-50. You're going to co-parent. That is the respect she has for you. So Justin is never late. Go and make peace. Even if the both of you are not going to live as husband and wife, but you can still, you know, be friends. Yes, that's my own advice for you. And stop being depressed. This guy does not have peace since he left Kora Obidi. There's no peace in his heart. I pray that the Lord will, will give you the strength because at this point, guys, it's not very easy for this guy. You need to, to hear the way he talks about Cora, Cora on the internet, talking about her, her riches, how rich she is, how she's making money on social media. So many things this guy is talking about on the internet, guys. But I'll leave you to drop your opinion on the comment section. Tell me what you think about this post he made. Is it that he is having regrets? He wished to turn the hands of the clock, which is not possible if you ask me, but maybe by the grace of God, it could be possible. So drop your opinion on the comment section. See you guys in my next one. Bye.